Check in on the weather. Meteorologist Josh Nichols tracking your seven weather forecast. Yeah, hi there, Taylor. I can hear the steel drums from here. <laughs> it certainly was a uh, fantastic uh, day here today in our uh, fair Queen City. Plenty of sunshine. The time lapse uh, of downtown shows that very, very nicely. And still holding on to that sunshine, result of some stable air that has moved in off of Lake Erie. 74, your top temp today after a morning low of 55. Note that sunset time at 854. Ah. It's a magical time of year. So for this evening, uh, definitely largely dry outside of a rogue shower, especially along the Lake Ontario shoreline. Might see one or two as well in the western southern tier. But otherwise, the showers should fizzle once the daytime heating subsides. And for your day tomorrow, even though there will be some showers around in the morning, it is not going to be an all-day washout. So if you uh, have some plans, just to bring along an umbrella. You might have to dodge a raindrop or two in early next week. Well, if you've got some time off, you are in luck. It is going to be absolutely absolutely picture perfect. So Allentown Art Festival still underway as we head into Sunday again. An umbrella would probably be a good idea. Temperatures will be close to 70 degrees into the afternoon. Again, some of those showers around mainly into the morning, but a lot of dry time, I think, later into the afternoon. Right now, Buffalo 74 degrees. Check out the wind. It's out of the southwest, fresh at 17 miles per hour. And that is why we have seen so much sunshine here in Buffalo. That is the oasis effect, the cooler air over Lake Erie comes inland and then you get uh, that lake breeze boundary that sets up away from the lake and that tends to be a focus for a couple of those uh, pop-up showers. Same is true up towards Niagara Falls. A little bit of convergence there setting up a shower for you here soon. 73 the temperature in Niagara Falls. 77 right now uh, into uh, areas just east. 66 in Cattaraugus and again that lake water temperature at 60 degrees. So nice breezes coming in off the water. There's our next weather maker. That's what's going to deliver increasing clouds for tonight and some of those showers for tomorrow. Again there's the oasis effect. That darker area on the view from space here. The visible satellite. That's the clear sky. And then you see the lake breeze boundary where we have had a couple of showers pop up. Uh, one such shower out around, uh, oh, just north of uh, Jamestown here uh, and uh, north of uh, 62. Even an isolated uh, thunderstorm to talk about as well out in the western end of Lake Ontario. This is tracking east, should skirt by Niagara on the lake in the next half hour. So our future cast shows a couple of these pop up showers here as we head in through uh, this evening. And then the heating of the day goes away. We're left with increasing clouds. There's the next uh, weather maker comes in tomorrow morning with a few showers, maybe a rumble of thunder into the afternoon, a couple of pop up showers, mainly south and east of the Chautauqua Ridge. But I think Buffalo is largely dry late in the afternoon, so you'll get in uh, some time to enjoy uh, the festival and so much more. Maybe a barbecue later on for uh, tomorrow night. We'll see decreasing clouds and then right now I think the stage is set for some gorgeous weather heading into your Monday. 75 is your top temp for Monday with a good supply of sun Tuesday. A couple of uh, scattered showers will develop and that is ahead of a warm front that promises to send our temperatures well into the 80s by the time we get towards Wednesday and Thursday. The heat is on. The humidity is back. A little bit of a case of the uh, ickies and stickies mm. uh, for, for a day, <laughs> I think. And then it's back to cooler times at the end of the week with uh, developing sunshine. Going to need more of those steel drums then, huh? Yeah, I want the steel drums yeah. and the... Uh, no, the LA? Yes. yes. LA. yes. <laughs> it's a huge party. And the uh, flower shirts as well. All right. Yes. Okay, we can make that happen. Okay. <laughs> awesome. Good. I would also need a win for the bandits. Yeah. Talk about a party. Doesn't get much better than Banditland Buffalo, though, on the road.